Today we will teach you how to make three different types of quilling flowers. You can use quilling flowers to make cards, decorate envelopes, on pots or to even try a different project like a jewellery holder in the link above. We will now give the quilling circle the shape of a drop by pressing it on one side and further moulding it with a slight tilt. If you want your quilling flower to have only 5 petals, use only half the yellow strip so that the bud is smaller. Quilling flower number 1 is ready. To give the petal of your quilling flower the effect of being slightly sunk from the top, use your finger on a tightly rolled quilling strip to push at it a little so that it rises just as you can see in the video. To make this fabulous 3D quilling lotus flower, follow our step-by-step -step instructions and you're sure to be amazed. Place the petals of the quilling lotus flower slowly and steadily and only move on to the outside round with larger petals once the inner one has dried completely.